like that. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna be captain. So all y'all really know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Quick draw. Mm -hmm. I'm sick, y'all. But question: If anybody's supposed to kill a Christian, is this Saul? Right. It's lit fraud. Mm -hmm. I turn big dog to John Wick dog. Turn it off. I turn big dog to John Wick dog. You know John Wick. John Wick had the dog that Helen gave him that died in a home invasion by Tarasov. If you watch John Wick and you know about the big... What? Saga! Where you been, nigga? What? I turned big dog to John Wick dog. URL, y'all got one with this shit. This is crazy. Uh, bitch, I've been a dong. Don Fleguito, you sweet as Cinnabon. Uh -huh. I, I, say, I said, bitch, I've been a dong. Don Fleguito, you sweet as Cinnabon. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't believe the type of niggas that play with they nose. They buzz my intercom. Oh. VA trips, hotel traps. We was in them Jones. I seen a nigga face an eight ball, then go to work at the Pentagon. So Whoa! Yeah, see? This is the shit. That's what I'm talking about. I seen a nigga sniff a whole eight ball, then go work at the Pentagon. Ooh, I ain't giving y'all no more balls, but golly, all right, all right, I'm liking this one. Skip the intro, let's get straight to the info. Gang, 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 I'm feeling this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. URL, Ultimate Rap League. Salute to everything that y'all got going on. I know y'all be feeling like the media hates y'all, like there be narratives painted against y'all, but I do want to say this, right? Because I don't really care about all that, you know what I'm saying? I say what I want. Cut the camera on. If it's good, it's good. If it's bad, it's bad. It is what it is, right? Um, Y'all got one with this, right? And I'm going to talk about the chess, my thoughts about chess and et cetera later, a little later in this joint. Lou Castro versus the Saga. You know how sometimes in life there be battles that you never knew you needed until you got them? This is one. Like, you know, this, this is one, right? So... I'm chilling yesterday, I'm on my way back to the crib, and I'm like, yo, <clears throat> I seen a notification pop up. I said, all right, cool, I checked this, I rock with Saga, you know, Luke Castro, I like when Luke Castro does the big dog, whoop -de -whoop. so I watch it, and you know, this first of all, this is for the Netflix joint, I guess they got a documentary coming on Netflix about battle rap, salute, battle rap, taking it to every single platform, elevate, 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 you know what I'm saying, that's, that's what it's supposed to be about, I know a lot of people... Just want Battle Rap to be stuck on YouTube forever, and that's one thing, you know what I'm saying? But the Ultimate Rap League has, you know, built a business, made their app. The app has had complaints. There have been gripes. There have been... I've been vocal about it, you know what I'm saying? I didn't like the speed that the battles get released in. I don't like the fact that the battles all get released in one day. I said they should have app-exclusive content that draws you to it. Like, where are the battles in the barbershop? Where are the battles outside? Where are the random battles that happen? And they, they got it, they got it, they got it. Now, I'm not saying that because of the complaints or whatever the case may be, but just the fact that the way this was, this is all I ever wanted, nigga. I ain't stupid, ain't no dummy, nigga. Couple figures on a couple triggers. A boogie. Now, this is all I ever wanted. You got New York versus New York. You got the Saga versus Luke Castle. Now I know, you know, neither is at the top, top, top of their game recently. You know what I'm saying? I know Saga has been building his brand. He's been taking a lot of battles on Gates of the Garden. He's been doing one rounders. You know what I'm saying? He had a battle um, versus my man in um, King of the Dot. King of the Dot. Rest in peace, Pat Stay. That event right there. I think, was it Arcane? He had a battle up there. I didn't see it. I will see it when I get the time to. Lou Castro, we all know the year that he had last year. They tried to give him the push, you know, the system push, that easy to block captain push, that uh, Ichigati push, that twerk push where you get all of these names. I think he had Charlie Clips, uh, Rum Nitty. I could just start there. And then all the battles that he had after that. I think he only, they said, allegedly, he only beat Big T. If you only beat Big T during the year, it's not a good look for you. I'm just be honest with you. Oh, he had a two-on-two -two with Jazz. They was, you know, trying to put Luke Castro in that new light. And what I, what I said um, is that I felt like Luke Castro didn't have a lot of big stage moments. Like, I just, at that point, like, when I first saw him, when he was coming up, I felt like he was nice. I know everybody wanted to compare him to twerk, et cetera, et cetera. But I saw Luke Castro stop that fucking shot clock, Showtime Battle League. I saw him back then, so I don't, I didn't get 
drawn to that comparison. Plus, him and Twerk Battle back in the days. You can go watch that shit, too. So, I seen him get up, rock, you know what I'm saying, make it to URL, do some things, get to the bigger stages. And when he got there, you know, the Arsenal joint, save me, save me, bro, save me. And the thing is, he has star power, but the star moments have to go with the star power. You just can't be a phenomenal, you know, camera guy or talking shit or being funny and things like that. And the battles were not equaling up to it. He went to Fonz. He battled Fonz at Chris Brown's house and got fried. Luke Castro got fried like five, four or five times last year. I'm going to just be honest. In order to keep it a buck, I got to be honest. You know what I'm saying? I know Luke Castro's from the Bronx. I'm from the Bronx, too. I love New York. I love New York MCs. That's why I'm going to talk about chess at the end of this, too. Now, like I said, Saga has been doing the music joint. He got the 4 a.m. Uber. Stream that joint. Um, he's been doing his thing as far as with the battle rap. Two on twos, one on ones. He had a two on two with Abel not too long ago. What, what more can I say? So, they come into this joint. My expectations wasn't high, I'm gonna be honest with you. I was like, oh, you know, it'll probably be a cool joint. This joint was easily, as a one round battle, I'm gonna say top eight. Probably one of the top eight battles of the year. And off of, uh, off of the app, Easily top four or five battles that I've seen released on the app this year. I don't give a fuck if it was three rounds, two rounds, one round. The energy that these dudes had between each other was insane. And the cameras, bro. The cameras must have been like 15K. Fuck a 4K, fuck a 8K. Bro, you've seen everything. The way they panned around and the way they was filming the crowd. If you got the app, go see it. Like, go see Lou Castro versus the Saga. And then not to mention the bars. Yo. So again, I took a couple clips. I throw a couple clips. URL, don't bring my fucking video down. Don't you bring my fucking video down. I swear to God. I swear to God. Don't bring my video down. I'm supporting you niggas. Do not bring my fucking video down. I swear to God. None of you battle rapper niggas say something to me. I'm too. I'm serious too. I'm talking to him and you niggas be sensitive and I'm saying the truth. Leave me alone. I like most of y'all. It'll get ugliest bowling shoes in this bitch. <laughs> Shout out to fucking Lloyd Banks. Don't bring my shit down. I'm supporting you niggas because nobody don't be covering y'all artists. Stop fucking playing with me. You know where I'm at in this shit. I know I started way, way, way down here. Well, I'm My shit, where Bobby Smurdis had his ass. Stop fucking playing with me. I know y'all be doing that dumb shit. Um, now back to it. Saga comes into this joint. He's wildin'. Like, wildin', wildin'. You gonna get some fortified pressure. Hey, big dog, they should have told you the Lord is my shepherd. I ain't got no motherfucking notes. I don't need no notes. I'm that guy. So he's wilding on him. What? He said, whip the pot. But he ain't know he had the skill it takes. Whoop. He had the whip the pot, but he ain't had the skill it takes. Nigga, no notes, motherfucker. Um, and then he had, then he came right after that. Like the, the pockets of flows and the bars that he was using was crazy. Um, he walked off, like he walked off and the camera panned off when he walked off. Uh, he was wilding. The, the Lou Isle, he said all they gonna hear, you know, it's like, Doopla playing, Doopla playing, all they gonna hear is Lou Ah, dang, the Lou Isle dang bar. What? This nigga Saga was bugging. But Saga's first round, phenomenal. I, mean, I was thinking, what is Lou Castro gonna do because this first round by Saga was phenomenal. Is he gonna step in here and get his ass cooked? Is he getting cooked? Am I sending this to the Bronx? Bro, the nigga comes out, he's wildin'. He's wildin' in this first round. The tails from the crib line, uh, the, yo. <laughs> he's talking about the, you know, the, the choreography joint. You gotta slow down, like, yo, look at me, man. Like, yo, Lou Castro was in a fucking bag, like, there are gonna be people who's gonna call this battle both ways. I'm calling it three. You know what I'm saying? Three. Shout out to three letter man, but not that three. I'm calling it three. Three is because I need to see three rounds of this shit. Like I said, I never seen many battles that I didn't think I needed to see until I saw them. You know, this is oh shout out to uh, Cobra Kai. I know Saga be liking all that. I big dog, the John Wick dog. You know what I'm saying? I know you be liking that type of shit. I actually got this at like a. Uh, Christmas party at my job. It's probably like five dollars from Walmart or some shit. You know, niggas be giving you them cheap ass gifts. But I figured I was getting wild strong, so I figured I'd throw it on. You know, you know, you know, niggas be knowing they be having shirts that be like, you know what I'm saying? When you work out and shit, you got you got them shirts. It's one of them. So uh, don't mind me. Um, but phenomenal, phenomenal battle. One round joint. I really wish it was three. I'm not gonna lie. 
Um, I don't, I don't, I, uh, best saga on URL I've seen in a little minute. And best Lou Castro I've seen on URL for a little minute. This did something for both of them. That's a crazy thing. Now, there are going to be a lot of people that I've I seen the votes and the votes on the little um, round by round shit on the app. They do have saga winning by a slight margin over Lou Castro, but I need three rounds. I need three rounds of this. Um, Dope, 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 dope. Salute to uh, Lou Castro. Salute to Saga. I don't know how long y'all had to prepare for this battle. I'm not even going to speculate or spec you hate. You know what I'm saying? Um, but they, they, they did that motherfucking thing. Y'all know how I am. I could be super critical. You know what I'm saying? Put that shit in rice. It was horrible. These niggas was ass. It wasn't that. They was bugging all throughout. And I don't want to give all of the lines because I ain't writing them down anyway. I was chilling. But I did remember the shit that really, really, really came to mind and uh, was hitting like that. It was filmed in like 15K. I don't know what kind of K it was, but it was a lot of Ks in that motherfucker. The only person who really ain't react to no bars was Chess. Yo, Chess don't react to no bars. Like, bro, you gotta blow the roof off the building in order for this nigga to, to he don't be having no response. He just be like this. Now, I don't know if that nigga lives in the year 2053 or he spaced out or whatever, but this nigga, I was watching, I was like, yo, is Chess gonna react to a bar? Bro, he was like, when he had the Lord is my shepherd, he was like, now, I want to see Chess. I'm from the Bronx, Bronx bias. I'm from New York, you know what I'm saying? I know I'm a Giants fan, I'm a Nets fan, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Look, I even got a Knicks hat here, but you know, I'm from New York. Shout out to the Knicks. Knicks won last night. They're going to play uh, against Miami. That shit theory starts Sunday, and we'll see what happens with that. But I'm always loving New York any way the cake gets cut. But when it comes to the sports shit, I know I wear a lot of teams. I got all, I got my whole Lakers shit over there with Kobe. I got, I got every damn, damn near every team. So I'm not really with no cognitive bias, and especially if it looks good. This is a Boston Bruins hat. If it matches, I'm in it. If anything except for Dallas. I, won't, I don't own nothing from the Cowboys. I'll never wear nothing from them. So I am wrong. But uh, when it comes to chess, like I want to see chess again. I seen Rex chirping like he want that look with chess and make it happen. I, I, I look. Regardless of what anybody may feel with Rex is with his career, up, down, left, right, positive, negative, or indifferent, I'm always down to see him battle. And if I see three chess rounds like he had versus Easy, or when Rex battled Easy, it could definitely, definitely be a good battle. And URL is in need of stars right now. Like, they need people. Like, the, the, what Saga and Luke Castro did was very good work. You know what I'm saying? Saga, the thing about him is consistency. It's the same issue with Luke Castro. Consistency. You do that, y'all be having one battle, two battles, then y'all have a fucking, oh my God, I can't believe this shit. You have three battles, then oh my God, I can't believe this shit. Or y'all battle on Gates of the Garden, all these small leagues, do all this wild work, come back to URL. And then it's like, what? If you gonna do it over here and do it at the highest level, uh, like, yo, the niggas, the little Luke Castro first round. Oh, smack, it's been five years. It's the place I call home. You gotta watch the niggas who you let in your zone. He said, these niggas will jump off your ship, take pieces to make a, a boat of their own. That was a shot at Easy the Black Cat, and I'm just gonna be honest with that. That's how I felt. That's how I felt. I don't know how I felt. So they'll, 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 they'll jump off your ship, take pieces, and make a boat of their own. Luke Castro was in a different pocket with the flows. I couldn't even fucking believe it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't even have an intro to this video because I thought the shit was so hot. But uh, shout out to both MCs. I definitely wanna see Chess again. Uh, yeah, and I want to see him versus Rex. I mean, I'm with that. You know what I'm saying? This is an app battle recap. No, you know, they say niggas don't recap app battles, but when I see an app battle that has some fire or some smoke to it that I feel like it's something that I want to talk about, I'm going to talk about. But uh, salute to uh, all of the MCs involved. Salute to URL on their Netflix documentary. I hope it turns out best. You know what I'm saying? And uh, do me a favor. Don't be a stranger. Subscribe to the channel if you respect the handle. And URL, don't take down my goddamn video just because I put a clip or two of y'all battlers in there. Y'all niggas don't even promote this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a hustler, B.